And welcome back, folks, to another exciting episode of Alan Wake. We are still kind of running away from the police and the taken ones. Hello? The most stubborn man I've ever met. Alice? Alice? Alan. Alan. I'm so afraid. It keeps me in the dark. Please help me. I look at you, Alan, and it's not you. It's something else. Looking out from behind your eyes. Alice, I'm here. I'm so alone here. It's all gonna go to hell. You need to be careful. Cooperate. The connection had been terrible, but that wasn't the only thing that hadn't been right with the call. She sounded wrong somehow, but she had called me. Hmm. All right. The pipe wrenched itself loose from the bridge's steel framework. Wrapped in darkness, it floated in midair, twitching. For a moment, I didn't understand what I was looking at. The heavy object lurched at me with impossible force. I threw myself out of the way, but just barely. When I turned my flashlight on it, it shook in a dark rage before it flew at me again. Right, so we are about to face that kind of foe next, but first we gotta check out a little stash over here, possibly. Let's see. Yeah. There we are. Ooh, there's a ton of stuff here. I'm actually at maximum revolver ammo. I'm surprised. <laughs> Batteries, flares, that's good. Might need those flares to stun the enemies when they get too close again. Oh. Ah! Right, flare time. Got this. And we can charge up on ammunition again. No biggie. All in all, we still gained ammunition and flares from this little encounter, so everything's good. We are getting close to that uh, to the train bridge. I could see a railway bridge up ahead and a warehouse of some sort on the opposite shore. I hoped I could find a car from there. Hmm. Follow. Alright. Guess I will. On the other hand, what the... this might be, though. The darkness that was pursuing me was growing stronger, and it was taking over everything in its path. Ow. Wait, what? What? Ow. Oh god! Oh no, what the hell? Flash! Flare! Flare! Oh no! I'm still not gonna survive this! Oh, I'm dead. 
How am I supposed to? Oh boy. Ah, we're all the way back here. That's uh, that sucks. All right. And I think my my only weapon against these possessed objects is actual light. So I don't. Uh, so I don't have. Uh, using the pistol probably won't do anything. So I'm gonna have to try and avoid instead and uh, use the flare more aggressively, maybe. I don't know. The See. darkness that was pursuing me was growing stronger, yeah. and it was taking over everything. In the Maybe I can be run. I don't know. Yeah, flash, flare. Come on, flare. There we go. Ow! They still hit me. And the second flare. Come on. Pretty much my only hope here. Are they gone? Only temporarily. Oh god. Get away. Get out of here. Ugh, I'm so dead. Oh no. <laughs> More stuff. Oh no. <laughs> they, they seem to regenerate or, or spawn new ones because I had taken out everything and then new stuff arrived. So maybe I'm not even supposed to fight them. Maybe I should just run. I don't know. Fighting them doesn't seem to really work. Come on. We are gonna we're gonna run away. And get to that warehouse as quickly as possible instead. I think we are gonna use one of those flares, but the only to hold off. Me was yeah yeah yeah. Longer, and it was taking over everything in its path. Right. So we are gonna use the flare to hold off the enemies but we're not gonna throw it away won't let me pass you piece of junk right man these things run out immediately alright uh, time for the second one maybe oh no I dropped it I'm crying out loud let me get out of here ow <laughs> this is horrible alright we are somewhere. No, I died again. <sighs> how do I how do I do this? And again we start back here. Really sucks honestly. I can't take all of them out. But if I run past then I get hit from behind and killed. Maybe maybe I do have to take him out, but I have to take it more slowly. Let's try that maybe. I didn't have that was yeah, 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 I know, I know. And it was taking over everything in its path. Thanks for telling me. Alright, now. Right, so this raises up, so we can't go back. Instead, we're gonna have to use our flare here as a little protective device and shoot at these things with our flashlight. Alright, come on. Oh god, no. Find out loud. There's just too much stuff everywhere. I can't stop it all. Ow! No, of course, the last one probably. <sighs> Am I supposed to fight this stuff or not? Can't tell. Mm. This is really tricky because I can't get away. It's also. So restrictive, the, the entire area is so small. And I think they can pretty much rush me wherever I am. Alright. The darkness that was pursuing me was growing stronger. And it was taking over everything. Shut up! Alright. Oh, 
Alright, let's try this again, maybe. Maybe I can duck out of the way or something. I'm dead already again. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I can't make this, folks. I, I don't survive this. We're gonna have to try it again and run. And then maybe turn around and just destroy the stuff that's right behind me because <laughs> I can't survive that. Not that kind of barrage. It's insane. Right. Let's try to get through as quickly as possible. And then turn around and destroy anything that's following me, I guess. And he's gonna repeat it a little. Yeah. And we're taking over everything in his path. Sure thing. Right. Now. Run. Use the flare. And try to get past. There we go. Flare dropped. I'm running. Oh god. There's stuff everywhere. Oh, that's insanity. What the hell? How can this be so difficult? Some of the other sections weren't easy, but certainly not that difficult. What the hell? Well, let's try this again, I guess. To get out of here somehow. I'm just gonna repeat this little sentence again, and I'm gonna get bored. The darkness that was pursuing me was growing stronger, yeah. and it was taking over everything in its path. Okay. Get a breather. There we go. Now let's do this. All right. Oh, come on! How am I supposed to dodge that? Whoa. Right? Ugh! Ugh! No! Come on! What is this crap? Uh, only I didn't have to walk all this way all the time. It's not that far, but I've seen this little bit more than enough times by now. that was pursuing me was growing stronger and it was taking over everything in its path. Right, now take another breather. And please make it this time, dude. Come on, drop a friggin' flare or something. Get through here. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I can't run while I'm holding a flare? What the hell? Okay, well, so much for the flare. Is there anything behind me now? Guess not. Why is it suddenly so easy? Right. Guess we made it this time. I honestly have no idea why, because it didn't really do anything differently. Not too much. Let's read it. I slammed the door shut right in his smug face. He pleaded for me to open the door. True to form, the asshole actually thought I would obey. I had no sympathy left. No guilt either. Not for him. 
I took a moment to savor the scream. I bet I had a smile on my face. It was all that I had time for. The dark presence was inside the lodge with me. Unless he's talking about the kidnap, I... I don't know who... As a teenager, just started to get interested in writing. Stephen King had been a source of inspiration to me. I thought about all the inanimate objects that had come to life in his books. No one is safe in a good horror story. Certainly not the protagonist. That's what makes them fun. This was anything but. The darkness could possess anything. And it was getting closer. What's the difference between the heavy duty and the normal one? Maybe it has more more energy? That would be good. Let's pick up some of this stuff, yeah, that's good. Guess we're getting somewhere now. Man, that took ages to get past that little little section there. Coffee. Ah, oh, thank God. Whew, I thought things were going wrong for a moment there. Right. Ah, uh, some emergency supplies that might come in handy. Again, no health kits or anything like that. I guess they are needed in this game, but uh, still, it's a bit odd. Flare, yeah, we had to use both flares to get through that little possessed object section that was crazy, honestly. There we go. What? Okay, well it's just a couple of dudes. Oh, come on. Oh. Oh! What's going on? That's what makes them fun. This was anything but. The darkness could possess anything. And it was getting closer. Alright, let's pick this stuff up again. I guess we're gonna equip the uh, the shotgun instead. I do have to pick up the, the... Okay, yeah, the thermals again as well. That's fine. Let's pick up that flare. And, hmm... Are these explosives, I wonder? I think I might try that. Some more stuff here? No. Limit reached. Okay. Yep, here they come. <laughs> All right. So yeah, we, we obviously gotta use the surroundings a little bit if we want to conserve ammo. So I'm gonna switch back to my pistol. It should be sufficient. Okay, I guess we gotta go through here. Whoa! God damn you! Ow! Oh no, there's another one. <laughs> I'm gonna get hit again, aren't I? Uh. You can die really quickly in this game if things don't work exactly the way you want them to. As the other dude. There we are. Take him out first. Hey, I tried to avoid that. Oh no! Guess it's not as easy as I thought it would be. What the hell?
go, you jerk. Oh! Hey, I, I tried to dodge that one. What is going on here? Alright. I just gotta check something. Do I have to pick up the, the, the thermos again? Or was it saved along with the checkpoint? I hope it was saved. It doesn't appear to be there, so I guess it was saved. Okay, then. So I only have to pick up the thermals again if you uh, if you die before getting the next checkpoint. From the looks of it. Right. Well, that one guy was really tough. The other one did not take much damage at all to kill. Light. Yeah, yeah. These repeat themselves a lot. Oh, that's fine. More flares. More bullets. Oh, another television. Let's see, maybe there's another Night Springs episode. We take yeah. the facts of our existence for granted, unaware that they are merely a thin veneer of desperate self delusion, covering a vast cosmos of madness and horror. All too often, the stars are right. In Night Springs. Tonight's episode, A Family Occasion. Journalist Alvin Durless trip to study the local customs of an insular community in Night Springs has been less than successful. Until tonight. Well, I'm glad you changed your minds about this. Ancient customs, local mythology. My editor loves this kind of stuff. Well, Mr. Derleth, we don't want to feel like we're on exhibition. But you have demonstrated the seriousness of your intent. Oh, I am serious. Really, just do your thing. I'll stay out of your way and observe. Actually, I thought you could assist us. I'm afraid we are a man short. It would provide you with an intimate perspective. Could I really? Of course, Mr. Derleth. Well, I guess that's the least I... What would I have to do? Oh, here. Let me show you with a kiss. I, uh, I... Mm. <laughs> what, what did you... Oh, Mr. Dwarf, you have well pleased Nixie Perka, the dweller in flesh. Your body shall host his thousand young, and all shall be glory. <laughs> Cthulhu-like. Very Lovecraftian. Oh, what's this? The darkness surged towards me, sucking everything loose from the ground into its depths, tugging at my clothes. I saw the flare the kidnapper had dropped and threw myself towards it just as I felt my feet leave the ground. The darkness embraced me with the force of a tornado. Somehow I managed to light the flare. The darkness roared and cast me away. I fell toward the dark waters of the lake far below. Okay, that sounds like it'll be tricky. Find a vehicle, okay. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's the vehicle. Um, oh god. What the hell? <laughs> Stop it! Oh no! Oh no! No! Oh. Damn it. That thing just ran right over me. That's 
fine, just don't do that again. Oh no! What are you doing? Right. Oh! The thing is just too fast for me. Okay, there we go. Did it kill all the other folks? Might have. Whoa! But let's kill this thing. But it's flickering in and out of existence, kind of. There's a new one. Um, whoa! No, 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 no! about dead by now? No! Uh. Ah. It doesn't care at all about the... Uh, uh. No! It ran me over! It doesn't care at all about flares apparently, unlike the normal dudes. Okay, well, I guess the normal dudes keep spawning, so I have to really focus on it. Right, you keep on coming, dude. You keep on coming. Right. Whoa. Oh, no, no! Ah, I'm... I'm... I keep getting stuck between objects. Alright, wow, this game got difficult and fast. It was so much easier, just just a few minutes earlier. What what's going on here? If only it was just a bulldozer. There's always more. Like right behind me! Right. Well. Hit me twice! What a jerk! Alright, there we go. Now. Now we can hopefully focus on this awful, awful thing! I think the flare... Right, I think the flare does deal damage to it. But uh, it doesn't... It does, it, it's not afraid of it. No, don't do that. I'm almost dead again. Here, yeah, another flare for you. Ah! Duck out of the way quickly. Stop ramming stuff into me! No! And I'm dead again. <sighs> this is insane. If only new enemies didn't spawn all the time, that would make it much easier already. Right, here you come. Take this thing out and fast. Wow, it's, it's almost dead already. What the hell? Hey, what the hell? It's almost done. It's done! What? That was way easier for some reason. 
All right, uh, another flare, just so I can survive this right here. Right, where are the enemies? There's one. Oh, duck out of the way. Insert battery and recharge. There we go. Phew. And did we actually make it now or not? I think we did. Okay, so I guess the lesson here is uh, focus entirely, pretty much, on the uh, on the bulldozer to take it out quickly and stop the spawning of new enemies. That's pretty much it, I guess. Let's pick up all these supplies. Plenty of flares now. That's good. Wow, that was intense. Why is the game so difficult all of a sudden? Alright. Now let's see here. What's that? More batteries? Hey, <laughs> I can't even pick them up. Alright. Coffee. Alright. Okay then. Hmm. Well, it's a car. We can use it. I think we are gonna end this episode soon. So we're gonna get inside. I had never been this glad to see the sunrise. I had a couple of hours to get to the coal mine. far now. Today, I would meet the kidnapper, and he would give me Alice. I wouldn't give him any other choice. A drowning man will clutch at a straw. Right. Well, I think this is where we ended for now. We got through some pretty hefty fights there. I think we'll be alright. Yeah, so uh, join me in the next episode, folks. And we will hopefully get to exchange that stupid manuscript for Alice. See you then, folks. Bye.